so today I'm going to share with you my Bath and Body Works collection and this is pre no buy. If you guys haven't seen my last couple of videos, basically I'm putting myself on a Bath and Body Works no buy until the next semi-annual sale which will probably start in June. Um, this is so I can use up my collection, get rid of products I don't really want anymore, um, and really downsize and make room for new things. I didn't realize how many Bath and Body Works products I had until I pulled it all out to show you guys and it's kind of embarrassing. It's pretty massive, so I hope you guys are ready for it. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys uh, where I store everything at first because I store it in a few different places, which is why I didn't realize I had so much because it's all kind of scattered throughout my room. So I'm going to take you and show you where I store it, and then I will pull everything out because um, it's just easier that way and show you guys everything all together. And then um, later on, right before the next semi-annual sale, I will pretty much do the same series of videos again. I will show you my... Um, like collection again to show you if I've used anything up. You can see if I've downsized it at all. And then I will also do a video with all the products I did use. Um, and of course I will do another haul. So this is the last of the Bath and Body Works videos for a while, but I hope that you guys enjoy this collection. Like I said, it's pretty massive. So prepare yourselves and I hope that you guys enjoy seeing it. Okay, so if you guys saw my perfume collection, then you saw that I stored all of my body splashes in this box. So this is where I keep all of my Bath & Body Works splashes. Um, but I have actually added, since that video, the minis. Um, I did have all my travel size things together, but I had too many, so I had to kind of readjust. So I have minis and large ones in there as well. And then in this little storage thing, the very last um, drawer has all of my travel size items and then I have my pocket backs right here which I think this is just some of them I don't think all of them fit but maybe so that is where I keep all of my travel size items and then I have one more place that I want to show you I have this little like storage organizer in my closet which I'm not really going to do like a big overview and show you it because that can be a totally different video if you guys want to see my closet organization let me know but anyway in this top <laughs> bin which is super heavy I have all of my full-size products, which it doesn't really look like that much, but this bin is ridiculous. Like, it fits so much stuff. I mean, you can see this, like, bottle compared to that bin. This bin is ginormous. So it fits all of my full-size um, body wash and body lotions. I did have some sprays in here, but it was, like, pushing it over the top. So I decided to just put the rest of my sprays in that box that I showed you guys for this. Um just makes life easier so that's everything I have and then of course I do have some stuff in my shower and whatnot and um, random products kind of floating around the house candles that I might I'm currently using and things like that um, the other place I do keep candles is in here these are a bunch of just like um, tea lights which these are really crappy tea lights um, don't ever get tea lights from Target they stink they do not work really very well at all and then I have my Bath & Body Works full-size candles at the bottom of that and then layers and, you know, tarts and whatnot. So that's where I keep my candles, um, but the majority of them, like the smaller ones that you'll see and um, one bigger one that I don't show in the video, unfortunately I forgot about it, my pink sangria candle. Um, I ha I'll have those out on my counters and stuff. So, yeah, that's where I store all of my products. So here it is, the moment of truth. I have pulled out every single Bath & Body Works product that I own. And I'm going to show you all my collection. Um, this is pre-no-buy. Um, just so you guys can see everything that I have. And like I said before, I am going to do a video after the no-buy is over and see how much exactly I have left over. Something that I wanted to show you guys before I get started on my collection is how I keep organized and know what I have. So what I do is I... Um, I don't know how well you can see this, but on my phone I have a notes, as I have an iPhone. And what I do is I make a note of my Bath & Body Works supply. Um, that way I can write down what I have, and then when I'm in the store, I know what I need and what I don't need. So I have two lemon um, travel size lotions and one lemon travel size body wash, and I just keep track of it like that. That way, if I'm going into the store, I know um, what I need to finish my trios and things like that. So that's a good idea. You might want to try doing that. While I have everything out, I'm going to update my list because I haven't in quite a while. So anyway, on with the collection. So over here I have my um, hand soaps. I have the Kitchen Lemon, the Pink Peony, and Fresh, ap fresh Picked Apples. I have the Christmas Scents, Ice Gingerbread, Candy Cane Bliss, and Winter Cranberry. I have three of the Creamy Pumpkin. 
I have four of the um, Brewberry. I really like that scent. I have two Vampire Bloods. I have one plum in this cute little thing. And then this, I think, is also a creamy pumpkin. Let's see. Uh, sweet cinnamon pumpkin. And that one. So those are all my hand soaps. Over here, I have my anti back. So I have this Cupcakes Blue Chiffon. The Cupcakes Coconut Cream. I have four of the Cupcakes in Red Velvet. This smells just like Red Velvet Cake. And I have a bunch of Halloween ones. So I have one in Pumpkin. Vampire Blood, The Ghoul Friend, Brewberry, Bat Bite, and I Love Bling. And then these are random products that don't really belong in any collection. I have two Plum Potion Lotions. I have one Black Candy Apple. I have a Malibu Heat Glowing Body Cream, which I haven't used yet. I have this tub of Lemon and Pomegranate Body Cream, which I'm about halfway through. Um, I have a cashmere glow lotion and I had two of these I don't know where the other one went I have a coconut passion fruit I have a um, aromatherapy sleep pillow mist which I need to put on my nightstand I have the super old coconut lime verbena body splash then I have a full set of the uh, summer's vanilla berry so I have one wash one lotion and then one spray um, over here is my be enchanted I have one um, travel size collection, so I have the travel size spray, the travel size body wash, and the travel size lotion, and I also have a full size um, shower gel. Over here I have the trio of Rio Rumberry, so I have one lotion, one shower gel, and one spray. Back there are my candles. I have three white bar number two chestnut and clove, which will still be in my next um, collection video because I won't have a chance to use that because Christmas time is over. And I also have a fresh balsam. Over there I have an aromatherapy um, candle. This is like one of the ones that help you sleep. And this is in lavender chamomile. And then I have a stress relief candle. And this is in vanilla verbena. Over here, you guys can probably tell that lemon is one of my favorite scents. So I have five shower gels, two full-size lotions, one full-size um, spray that's almost gone, and three travel size sprays. So I might try and dump some of these into that bare one just to kind of get rid of them. And I have two little lotions. Over here is my set of pink sugar plum. I have one lotion, two shower gels, and one spray. Over here I have my honey autumn apple, one spray, one body wash. Hopefully I will be able to get the lotion. Sorry, I gotta position myself better. Then I have a full set of the Dreamy Vanilla Wood, so I have one lotion that has been used, one shower gel, and one full-size spray. Over here is Twilight Woods. I have one lotion, one creamy body wash, um, two full-size sprays, one small size, and then one um, treble or anti-back um, in Twilight Woods as well. I have the trio in... Secret Wonderland, which is in my bathroom currently. I just pulled it out to show you guys. So I'm currently using the um, shower gel, the lotion, and the spray. And then I have Moonlight Path. So I have a full-size trio. This um, spray, the lotion, the shower gel, and then a travel size lotion, shower gel, and mist. Over here, I have my Dark Kiss, which unfortunately is being discontinued. I have a full-size mist a full-size shower gel, a travel-size mist, and a travel-size lotion. Over there, I have a full-size trio in Coconut Lime Breeze. So I have one full-size shower gel, which I have used a little bit of, one full-size lotion, and one full-size spray. And then I also have the travel-size lotion, shower gel, and this mist back here. I have some random uh, sweet pea. So this would be where I would put this in my phone and know that when I go to the store that maybe I should pick up the body lotion to complete the trio so that I can use this. So I have one shower gel, one mist, um, and two mini shower gels. Over here is my Bali Mango. I have one body lotion, one um, shower gel, a travel size shower gel, and three travel size lotions. This was the original packaging and then this was the new packaging. And I have one um, glitter mist. 
And then last but not least is my pink chiffon. I have one full-size shower gel, one full-size shimmer body cream, one um, travel size spray, um, and then two travel size shower gels, and one travel size lotion. So that is my Bath & Body Works collection. It is massive. I didn't even realize how big it was. I'm very happy that I'm going to be doing a no-buy with Bath & Body Works because, as you can tell, I have enough to last me a very, very long time. So I hope by the next time I do this video, um, my collection will be downsized. Looking at this, it makes me not even want to shop the next semi-annual sale, but... We'll see how much I go through. Hopefully I get through a good deal of products because this is ridiculous. So thank you guys so much for watching my collection video and I hope that you guys enjoy. And hopefully this inspires you to also do a Bath & Body Works no-buy. Bye guys, see you in my next video.